SpaceX has just made a game-changing announcement for Starship Flight 6. In a bold move that's got the entire space industry talking, they've deliberately removed critical sections of S-31's heat shield tiles. This unprecedented decision marks a radical departure from conventional spacecraft design, showcasing SpaceX's commitment to rapid innovation. But that's not all. Flight 6 will attempt something never before seen in Starship's history, reigniting the Raptor engine in space. This crucial test could unlock the future of orbital refueling, setting the stage for missions to the Moon, Mars, and beyond. The most fascinating part? SpaceX has strategically exposed sections of the thermal protection system around the forward flaps, potentially revealing their plans for an advanced catching mechanism that could revolutionize spacecraft recovery. With perfect timing for a late afternoon launch from Starbase, we'll witness this historic mission in broad daylight, capturing every dramatic moment as S-31 pushes the boundaries of space technology. Welcome to Elon Musk 24 Hours, your premier source for breaking SpaceX news. Let's dive right in. The sun beats down on Starbase as engineers make final adjustments to Starship S-31. What they're doing defies conventional wisdom, deliberately removing heat shield tiles from a spacecraft designed to endure the inferno of atmospheric re-entry. But this isn't reckless experimentation. It's calculated innovation that could redefine space travel. Inside Starbase's high bay, the atmosphere is electric. Teams of engineers work around the clock, meticulously checking and rechecking every system. The missing heat shield sections around the forward flaps catch everyone's attention. They're not just gaps, their windows into the future of spacecraft recovery. SpaceX engineers have developed a revolutionary ablative coating, rumored to be twice as durable as traditional tiles. If successful, this could slash Starship's weight by a fifth, dramatically increasing payload capacity for future Mars missions. The engineering team's excitement is palpable as they discuss the implications of their work. One senior engineer, working late into the night, explains how they've reinforced the exposed areas with a new composite material, a breakthrough that could change how we think about thermal protection in spacecraft. The material, developed in SpaceX's Advanced Materials Lab, combines unprecedented heat resistance with remarkable structural strength. But the real game-changer lies in what happens 37 minutes into flight. For the first time, SpaceX will attempt something that's never been done with Starship, reigniting a Raptor engine in the vacuum of space. This isn't just about proving the engine can restart, it's about validating the foundation of SpaceX's entire interplanetary architecture. Without this capability, orbital refueling becomes impossible, and the dream of Mars remains just that, a dream. The Raptor engines themselves have undergone significant modifications for this test. Engineers have refined the ignition sequence, optimized the fuel mixture ratios, and implemented new thermal management systems. Each change has been tested extensively in SpaceX's state-of-the-art engine testing facility, where the roar of Raptor engines has become a familiar sound to locals. The flight path itself tells a story of innovation. SpaceX has completely reimagined how Starship returns to Earth. The new steeper entry angle pushes the flap control systems to their limits, while modified aerodynamic surfaces handle heat loads that would melt conventional materials. Internal simulations suggest this approach could save 15% more fuel during landing, crucial for carrying larger payloads to Mars. In the control center, screens display real-time data from thousands of sensors. The new automated monitoring system, three times faster than its predecessor, processes this information continuously. It's designed to detect and respond to anomalies before they become problems, a crucial capability for a vehicle pushing the boundaries of space technology. The launch preparation sequence has been completely overhauled. Teams start hours earlier than previous missions, methodically working through enhanced pre-flight checks. The methane fueling process begins at T minus 49 minutes, carefully coordinated with the new engine chill procedures. Every step has been refined based on lessons learned from previous flights. Environmental considerations have taken center stage in this mission's planning. The flight path has been carefully calculated to minimize sonic booms over populated areas. The splashdown zone in the Indian Ocean was selected after extensive marine life impact studies. Even the launch pad modifications reflect this environmental consciousness. 
A new water deluge system reduces acoustic impact on local wildlife. As the sun sets, we get a glimpse of another innovation, the modified flame deflector system. This isn't just about protecting the launch pad, it's about understanding how Starship's massive thrust affects ground systems. The data gathered here will inform the design of future launch facilities on Mars. The mission's complexity extends beyond the vehicle itself. SpaceX has deployed a network of new tracking stations along the flight path, each equipped with high-speed cameras and advanced telemetry systems. These stations will provide unprecedented coverage of the flight, especially during critical phases like engine restart and re-entry. In the fabrication facility, teams are already applying lessons learned from S31's construction to future vehicles. The new heat shield attachment method tested on this flight could reduce assembly time by 40%. This isn't just about efficiency, it's about making Starship truly rapidly reusable. The landing sequence will be particularly dramatic thanks to the afternoon launch time. Unlike previous missions lost in darkness, we'll witness every moment of S-31's experimental descent over the Indian Ocean. The modified trajectory, steeper and more aggressive than ever before, will push the Starship's control systems to their absolute limits. Behind the scenes, the guidance team has developed new algorithms for the landing flip maneuver. These algorithms, tested thousands of times in simulation, adapt to changing atmospheric conditions in real time. It's a dance of precision and power, with Starship's massive flaps orchestrating the final descent. The heat shield modifications aren't random. They're part of a larger experiment in thermal protection. Sensors embedded in the exposed areas will measure temperatures and stresses during re-entry. This data will inform the development of next-generation heat shields, potentially enabling even faster turnaround times between flights. In the propulsion bay, engineers make final adjustments to the Raptor engines. These aren't just any Raptors. They've been specially configured for the in-space restart test. New ignition sequencers, modified turbo pumps, and enhanced thermal management systems make these engines unique. Every modification has been tested extensively on the ground, but space is the ultimate proving ground. The mission's impact extends beyond SpaceX. Universities and research institutions worldwide will receive data from this flight, advancing our understanding of hypersonic flight, materials science, and propulsion technology. This collaborative approach accelerates innovation across the entire space industry. As launch day approaches, the sense of anticipation grows. This isn't just another test flight, it's a bold step toward making life multi-planetary. Success here could accelerate SpaceX's Mars timeline by years, bringing us closer to the day when humans will walk on the red planet. The implications of this mission reach far beyond a single flight. The heat shield experiments could revolutionize thermal protection for all spacecraft. The engine restart capability could enable new types of space missions. The landing profile innovations could make space travel more efficient and reliable. But perhaps most importantly, Flight 6 represents humanity's unwavering drive to push boundaries. Every modification, every innovation, every calculated risk brings us closer to becoming a spacefaring civilization. As S-31 stands ready for launch, gleaming in the Texas sun, it carries not just experimental hardware, but the hopes and dreams of everyone who believes in a multi-planetary future. The mission control team runs through final simulations, practicing every conceivable scenario. The new automated systems have been trained on millions of potential flight conditions, ready to assist human controllers in split-second decisions. This fusion of human expertise and artificial intelligence represents another leap forward in spacecraft operations. As we await the launch, one thing becomes crystal clear. Flight 6 isn't just another step in Starship's development. It's a bold leap toward a future where Mars isn't just a distant red dot in the night sky, but a destination within humanity's reach. The innovations being tested here, from the missing heat shield tiles to the in-space engine restart, are the building blocks of that future. As Starship S-31 stands ready for its revolutionary flight, we're witnessing more than just technological advancement. We're seeing the future of space exploration unfold before our eyes. The deliberate removal of heat shield tiles, 
the groundbreaking engine restart test, and the innovative landing approach all point to one undeniable truth. SpaceX isn't just building a rocket. They're building humanity's path to becoming a multi-planetary species. This mission's success could fundamentally change how we approach spacecraft design and recovery. The experimental heat shield configuration and new landing profile aren't just incremental improvements. They're giant leaps toward making space travel more efficient, reliable, and ultimately, routine. The next few days at Starbase will be crucial as final preparations continue. Each modification, each test, each careful check brings us closer to launch day and closer to making Mars a realistic destination for humanity. Stay tuned to Elon Musk 24 hours for exclusive coverage of Flight 6, from final preparations through launch and recovery. If you want to be part of this historic journey to Mars, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. Share this video with fellow space enthusiasts who understand that the future of humanity lies among the stars. Drop your thoughts about these revolutionary changes in the comments below. Which modification do you think will have the biggest impact on future space travel? Leave a like if you're excited to witness history in the making. This is Elon Musk 24 hours, bringing you tomorrow's space technology today.